In this video, we are going to see the important DNA repair defects in dermatology. So, myself, Dr. Madhuran Shinvas, this is the today's MCQ. All of the following are associated with nucleotide excision repair pathway except so during the replication of the dna there will be certain defects which can be seen uh, to rectify them there are certain mechanisms some enzymes if there is a defect in each of these there are going to be certain diseases like for example if there is a defect in the nucleotide excision repair there uh, 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 can be the manifestation in the form of xeroderma pigmentosa cocaine syndrome and trichothyl dystrophy. Option C, mutoid syndrome is not associated with nucleotide excision repair. That's the reason why C is the answer for this question. And in the mutoid syndrome, it is mismatch repair, which is the basic DNA repair defect. And I'm very happy that almost all the students, whoever uh, has commented, have given me the correct answer. And this is going to be a very, very important, we can say, quick revision of all the dermatologically important diseases and their DNA repair defects. What is the specific type? You might have read more exhaustive list of uh, diseases in your pathology, but these are all the diseases important from dermatological standpoint of view. So you can see xeroderma pigmentosum, cocaine syndrome and trichothyl dystrophy. These are the important diseases uh, which are all due to the nucleotide excision repair defects. Then comes the group which are due to a defect in the recombination Q helicase. Recombination Q helicase and what are those diseases? Werner syndrome, Bloom syndrome, Rothman Thompson syndrome. These are the three conditions which are due to recombination Q helicase uh, defects. And uh, yes, again there are, you can see Muir Toyer syndrome which is due to the mismatch repair defect. Others are not very, very important. You might read them in the pathology, but these are important from dermatological standpoint of view. Mutoid syndrome, it is an example of mismatch repair, not nucleotide excision repair. And this is tomorrow's MCQ, which uh, is the primary target of action of androgen in hair follicle. Please post your answer in the comment section. You become what you believe. So your belief system is very, very important. You are where you are today in your life based on everything that you have believed in the past. So always we must believe ourselves about our success. Always you should think that I can do it. I hope this video was helpful. Please uh, do hit that uh, like button. And uh, thank you so much for watching this video till this point. Myself, Dr. Madhuri Shinvas. Happy learning. Sarvam Sri Krishna Arpanam Sarvejana Sukhina Bhant. Bye-bye.